Hey guys, what's going on? It's Jimblade8304 here, and today I am doing the best quotes from each ninja. Um, keep in mind that this is only Kai, Cole, J, Zane, and Lloyd, and Nia, and Sensei Wu and Garmadon. I did not include anybody else in this, just those eight characters. Um, but with any, with that said, let's get started. I am going to go through and read the quotes, um, Maybe give a quick little explanation on why I chose them, but other than that, let's start. Okay, Kai quotes. A ninja never accepts defeat. A ninja always picks himself up when he's down. That's the first one. It's not the size of a ninja in the fight, but it's the size of the fight inside a ninja. A ninja never admits defeat. Stay sharp, fellas. Whatever happens, never let your guard down. I hate technology. That, that's one of my favorite Kai quotes of all time, like... I feel that way sometimes too, like, oh my god, technology is like going to kill me today. <clears throat> next one is, hey, no one messes up my hair. Um, next one is, crime doesn't pay, muchacho, you can take that to the bank. And then the next one, if you can't stand the heat, get out of the kitchen. That, that's a pretty good one, that's when they were getting ready to throw the fang blades in the torch fire mountain, um, if you remember that. And then, the magic rope, we can climb to safety. A Kai, that, that's like one of the best Kai quotes too. Um, it's when they, when they find the new Samurai X, um, and then Kai thinks he sees a magic rope, and eventually he actually really does. And then, and that's when it was like hallucinating because of the Venomari Venom. And then the next one is look at Sensei's beard; it's moving like snakes. I was like. And that that one's pretty funny too, cause he was still on the Venomari hallucination stuff. Um, and his la the last one I have for him is fire, cause that's like he says that a lot of times. I think I don't really know. I just like it. It's very very nice. But um, I picked some of these because they were just funny. Um, most of these are from like the first couple seasons. Some of them were from more recently, but. Most of them were from the first couple seasons. Okay, Cole quotes. Next, first one is no one calls me a pedestrian. And it's like, and then this next one is I hate being kid. You can't drive. No one listens to you. And ah, bedtimes. And then when Cole says more like mouth of lightning. And then when Cole says to Edna, it was a pleasure hearing about Jay's first potty time. That was like one of the funniest things he's ever said. And Cole said, you mean there's not going to be cake? Cole loves his cake. Like, seriously, don't take the cake away from Cole. Um, then the next one is, Jay, how did you become a ninja? Seriously. Like, when they were, um, looking for the Temple of Light, they, that's when Cole said that. And then, when they were fighting the Great Devourer, Cole said, Zane, what was that? This isn't target practice. You're supposed to hit him, not give him a haircut. <laughs> one of the best quotes, too, from him. And then, in Rebooted, when he said, I am the MC, the mighty Cole. And one of the students yells, Mr. Cole is the worst. And he yells, I heard that. And then he also, when he was trying to help the civil, um, the people move the stuff, like clean up, clean up after they had a little accident, he's, Cole said, time for some old school muscle tool. Pretty good quotes from him. Um, most of these are actually relatively, like, most of these are from the second and third season. Um, the final, or... I mean, the first season, first and third season, Rise of the Snakes, and, um, Rebooted. Yeah. I was trying to think of it. <laughs> Alright, um, next. It's Jay quotes. His first quote is from when they were, um, like, stressed out about fighting the Great Devourer. They said, great, let me make a note of that. Giant Snake has wee itty bitty weak spot that will be totally impossible to get at because the thing's too ridiculously huge to do anything to stop it. That, that's like a amazing quote, um, it's one of the funniest things Jay said other than like the third to last, the second to last, or the third to last one I mean, um, so, and then the next one is, yeah, maybe we need, some, maybe air jitsu isn't uplifting enough, we need something more inspiring like Cyclone Do, that's when they were trying to learn air jitsu, um, and the, this, the next one's in the tournament of elements, you say, I used to use the power of positive, I choose to use the power of positive thinking. Um, Karloff says that, like, Karloff says, like, what happened to the power of positive thinking? Um, 
stuff like that eventually sometime during the same around the same time uh, Jay said this and Jay's like oh, we're saving a girl is she hot that's when he was that's when they figured out that that's when Jay found out they were saving Nia Kai's sister and then you know it kind of kind of set forward that Jay was going to end up being with Nia um then and then Jay says whoa Lloyd's going through puberty when he got possessed by um Moro in possession and then another one from possession is if you don't like sneaking around why become a ninja that that's really cool too it's funny uh, if you hear any noise I'm, I apologize about that it's just my foot tapping on my desk where I'm recording this um but anyway and then next time next quote or the next quote he says um is it makes me feel young deal with it that's when he had cotton candy in the episode child's play that was funny it's like it makes me feel young deal with it like okay um and then Jay yells at Nia saying, Nia, objects in the mirror are closer than they appear. When the Great Devourer almost, like, gets through and bites him, I guess, almost, kind of. And this is probably my favorite Jay quote of all time. Bequeath, bequeath, bequeath. When he was doing the Stone Army talk, I guess he was trying to do it. He, it was really stupid, but it was funny. <laughs> and then Jay's like, who cares about Ninjago? They have Nia. I was like... Ninjago is your home. There's more girls in Ninjago. It's like Jay's like, who cares about Ninjago? They have Nia. Um, and then the last quote I have for Jay is like, it says, let's chop sake this lemonade stand. Um, uh, I'm not sure actually when that was. I just know Jay said it. Um, most of these are relatively newer. Um, from Possession. Um, a couple of them from Tournament. So, um, but anyway, now we're going on to Zane quotes. This is, video is gonna be very long. The first quote I have is, I am the titanium ninja. That's when he figured out, he said he was not, I am not the white ninja. I am the titanium ninja. I was like, okay, so now you finally figured that out. It took you long enough. <laughs> Alright, um, next quote is, let's blow this popsicle stand. That's when he, uh, gets on his ice shredder and, or the ice, the snowmobile thing. And he, um, gets the ninja to leave after the... Pythor fails to unite the tribes. Um, Pythor is a failure to life, so you know. Mm. Um, and he says, and then the next quote is from Rebooted. These couple, next couple of these are from Reboot. Most of his are from Rebooted. Um, he says, I am a ninja, and ninja never quit. Go ninja, go. But before that, he said, support me, friends, for one last time. Let my friends go. And then another one from Rebooted is it says, This isn't about numbers. It's about family. But Kai says that first. I didn't put that with Kai because technically Zane said it kind of better because the season was mostly about him and he was... I, I don't even know what he, why he said that. I forget. Uh, he, was, he was fighting the Overlord. Oh, the Overlord said, um... Your survival chance is zero. This, and he said, this isn't about numbers. It's about family. Um, then he says to Pixel, you are vital to this mission, or this mission, and vital to me. I'm sorry. I've, and then his next one, this is my favorite one. I'm sorry. I seem to have devoured all the deli meat. Cheese? <laughs> That's one of his best quotes. That's probably one of my favorites. Funny wise, anyway. And his next one is, I know who I am, when he unlocks his true potential. Next one is, you ate an odd crustacean, when he, uh, try, we're trying to figure out, um, what Jay was saying. And then Cole said, you feel a weird sensation? And Kai said, no, I got it, I got it. Two natives on vacation. And then Jay says, tornado of creation! Yeah, I, I'm not sure how much that sounds like Jay. I really don't even know, but... And then um, said, charm your way out of this. I'm not sure when that was, actually. I forget. I'm not sure if that was while he was battling the Overlord or what when that happened. And then his next quote is, at least we get to break the ice. Yeah, ice pun. Woo, fun. And when he was trying to use a techno blade, he's like, it's not even sharp. Why call it a blade? Why even call it a blade? And then during the Great Devourer Rescue, he said, instead of a fire escape, how about an ice escape? That was really funny too. Um, but that's it for the Zane quotes. Um, next is Lloyd. 
Um, and he says, I am the ultimate spinjitsu master. And his next one is, unless my light is bright enough. And Lloyd says, even in the darkest times, there will always be light. And he says, in possession, take the sword, Kai. I can't hold it much longer. And his next one, this is my favorite, this one. This one right here that I'm about to read. Did you see me kick him in the face? I'm an asset. I kick butt and face. <laughs> that's, that's probably one of the best Lloyd quotes ever. Um, there are a couple other good ones. This one, I says, I want more booby traps. And he says, when he's fighting the overlord, I don't need a sword. And he also says, this ends now. And during Rebooted, he said, Robots versus Ninja, dare I ask. And also, he said, Overlord, I defeated you once, I'll defeat you again. These are, the last couple were more serious quotes, but the, probably the fourth one where my mouse is right now, like right here, that one, the kick him in the face part, um, that, pro that one's probably my favorite. And Nia, I don't have a whole lot for her. Um, because I couldn't find any, but just these are the four good ones I found. I put Nia slash Samurai X. You know. When, all right, the first one is when is this going to wear off? It's starting to get annoying. When Kai started, uh, um, when Kai was on the hallucination stuff for the Venomari Venom, I guess you could call it. That's when Nia said that. Um, and then when Jay unlocked his true potential, he before he said, just remember. You are the best you. And then she said, I'm a samurai. And then she's like, never tell me the odds when they were trying to escape from the Great Devourer. And she, she said that directed towards Zane. But, okay, we only have two more slides left to go in this video. But um, here are some Sensei Wu quotes. Never put off until tomorrow what can be done today. That That's one of the quotes I use in everyday life. No, just kidding, I never use that, like, I'd rather wait till tomorrow to do something. I was thinking, that's why I kept putting off this video, like, I, I kept putting off this video, I was like, thinking, I kept thinking, like, oh, I never put off until tomorrow, what can be done today? But it couldn't have been done today. Well, I mean, it was done today, but it couldn't have been done yesterday when I said that, because I wasn't done with it yet. But, what? and then he asked the question, what is the best way to defeat your enemy? It is to make them your friend. And then he says to Kai, when Kai says, Zane's weird. He says, what is weird? Someone who is different or someone who is different from you? Okay. Um, and this, the, the next two are my favorites. No pizza for you, he says. It's a, that's what. And then Cole says, well, what? And that's after he says, never put off until tomorrow. What can be done today? He said, and Cole says, well, I was going to eat this pizza tomorrow, later, but I, if that's the case, and Sensei Wu slaps it out of his hands and says, no pizza for you. All right, now that they're gone, all right, this is one after Ed and Edna left in that one episode, I forget which one, um, I think it's, I don't even know, I forget, <laughs> so many episodes, there's like 74 now. Um, now that they're gone, perhaps Jay can give us a lesson on pillow kissing. <laughs> that's my favorite one, definitely my favorite one. It, it's funny. It's hilarious. Um, that's it's kind of ironic because Sensei Wu's more serious than funny, I guess. Um, kind of makes sense. And then he says, "This is the final battle." While they're while Lloyd's fighting, getting ready to fight the Overlord. All right, our last slide is sen a Lord slash Sensei Garvanon quotes. All right, this I'll tell you which one's which from who. Um, this is Sensei, the first one. The cursed realm is a preeminent, and the preeminence is the cursed realm. Um, the second one is also Sensei. The battle of our past has returned, but we will rise to meet that challenge. This third one's also Sensei. Um, most of these are actually Sensei, except for the last two. Um, so just know that. Um, I yearn to make the world in my image. I had never realized I already had in you. That was towards Lloyd. Okay. Um, and he said, close your mouth and open your ears. He, and then he hit Jay on top of the head with a stick. I thought that was hilarious. Jay finally got what he deserved. <laughs> um, and he said, tonight's lesson is the art of the silent fist. That was actually in the episode, Art of the Silent Fist. The ninja actually used that. 
and then let your opponent fight himself. That's what the lesson was about. And it, and then Lord Garmadon's quotes that I have were, You bit me once, now feel what it's like to be bitten back. When he was getting ready to jump off the skyscraper. Um, to destroy the devourer with a weak spot with the four golden weapons. Ninja, you should not have done that. I don't know why all four of you just didn't jump off at the same time. Jump off the skyscraper at the same time, and you so that way you didn't have to give Garmin on them four weapons. But anyway, and while he was jumping off the skyscraper, he said, Vengeance will be mine. But anyway, that is the best Ninjago quotes from each ninja. Um, be sure to leave a like down below because it did take me about three weeks to do this. Um, comment what some of your favorite Ninjago quotes were, um, comment, tell me if I missed any that you liked, um, but with that, that's about it for this video, um, I will see you guys next time, oh, and by the way, before I sign off, um, Balloons Tower Defense 5 Season 2, that will be started, right after I post this video, it will be started, so, I am going to record the first episode of that and upload it. So, um, that's it for this video. This is Jimblade8304 signing off.